Hey, what's going on guys and girls? I'm Colleague Phoenix here and welcome to episode number four of my Don't Starve Let's Play series. So, I think I want to try feeding these guys um, some monster meat. I follow. Okay. Nice. You is good. You go smash? Really? You're taking on three of them, dude. Alright, do you wanna... Okay, he's dying. He's hurting them, but he's dying. I kind of want him to die, because I've got an idea. There we go. Hey! You fucking dick, dude! I wanted what he dropped, you rude bastard. Ow. Screw you, dude. Man, I'm so mad. I wanted what he dropped. So, last episode I got a comment from Emily Beach. Thank you for the comment, I really do appreciate it. That says, your priorities from here should be drying racks and at least one crock pot. Burn some trees down for charcoal and get those built. Cook meatballs for food, feed some pigs to chop wood for you, create some storage and start drying meat for jerky. Ideally, find some clockwork knights and kill one for gears so you can get a fridge. Okay. Then find some beefalo and kill it until you have a horn and can make a hat for Winnie. You should be able to just hit the butterfly or you can catch with a net and kill. You may want to collect enough silk for a top hat to get as much of the map explored as possible before winter. So this is very good news to have. And I appreciate the advice, Emily. I will try to follow it as best as I can. Alright, so what we need to do is we need to burn down a tree. Because that is how we get... Oh, no, I'm burning the whole forest down. Um... Can I pick my axe, please? Alright, so how much of this forest burnt down? Alright, so do you need charcoal? I've got unlimited charcoal. Um... Fuck. I did not mean to do that. Well, I did have a forest just next to me. Now I t Oh my god. Uh, I didn't think the fire would spread. Well, you live and you learn, don't you? Well, that fucked up my forest, uh, here. At least we've got a nice forest up in this area, though, as well. That's fine, that's fine. Ah, oh, god damn it. Hey, monster meat, right? Oh, it's a morsel. Hmm. So I would have killed basically anything that was in with the fire as well, right? Okay, so I do know I need some cut stone. Um, I think we need a couple of that, and we need some twigs, I believe, to make the crock pot. Because we should probably get that online to start cooking some food. Uh, let's see, food tab, it should be under. We want a crock pot. We need a drying rack and we need a crock pot. Okay, we need three cut stone for that. And where's the refinery tab? And then let's get the crock pot. Nice! So we can open the crock pot and we can cook stuff. I need to learn the recipes and stuff though. That's something I'll have to get uh, looking up on. And a drying rack is something else we're going to need. So we can dry out meat for the winter. Um, and... And Big In Gaming said, I think the Divining Rod will lead you to water, so maybe a pond, and I think you can make something to catch butterflies with a net. Yes. So I will have to get that done. Ah, oh, damn, it's sort of burnt. How many of the trees did it actually burn down, though? That is the question. Did it burn basically everything down? Well, it definitely killed a sp the spiders over here. 
Because there's not the silk here anymore. Okay, it did stop just up here. But for the most part, it did basically burn the entire forest down. Now, if I dig this out... I do, I do get... I get a sapling out of it. We can plant those close to our base, so that could be a good idea. We're going to need to go twig hunting as well. Because we have basically no twigs. We have one entire twig and that's it. Not the most helpful. Well, I could have enlisted the pigs to help me cut down everything, but now there's not much to, for them to cut down, is there, so... Fuck. Alright, let's get back towards the base. Now, I've got a torch made, as suggested by Emily as well, which is obviously a great suggestion. Always have a torch on me. It should really be common sense on my part. Can I see any twigs on this map? I can. I can see some down here. Okay. There is some in the vicinity, which is good. Alright. Let's get this fire lit, I guess. What have we got to use for the fire? Shit. I really don't have much, do I? I've got a couple logs. I'll use a couple logs and that's it. Alright, do we have anything that's actually going to bring up our health? Maybe the morsel will. Now, yeah, gave us a whole one health. Great! Ah, shit. Oh, spider glands heal. Oh my god. Nice. Okay, we've got 51 health. We're still in quite a bit of trouble in that way. Honestly, we're not we're not doing too crash hot. Uh can I do I have enough to make another torch? I don't. Shit. Could I make it to where that is with the remaining torch I have? Because then I could maybe grab some twigs. Let's see where these twigs are. Right here. They should be just here. Okay, now the first thing I'm going to do is make sure we have a backup torch. Okay. What are you? The stinkiest thing I've smelled all day. Alright, there's more pigs down here. Alright, let's just stop using the torch. We don't want to waste it. Alright, so these spider glands are super important to pick up if we get the chance. That is the good shit. So I actually wanted to turn, to get the pig turned into a were pig. Um, because if you turn it into a were pig, it actually gives you enough items to craft the hand bat. And I think the hand bat would be something good to have as well. Super important to have. In my opinion. Because it does like near on 60 damage. From what I was looking at. So that would be amazing to have. It does spoil after 10 days. But it lasts longer in winter. So if I could have that built just before winter. That would be fantastic. But basically what we've got to do is we've got to get some exploration done. Really. Um, we got to keep exploring more of the map. What have we got up here? Basic farm. Oh. oh, yeah. Thank you for the sub, sweet gamers, unturned Fortnite more. Um, yeah, I've accidentally got my sub stuff turned on. Yeah, let's just heal. Nice. So this is a metal potato thing. I should try planting some crops. Uh, do I have anything I can plant? I need seeds, right? Do I have seeds? Plant. Plant. Nice! Okay, well, we got seeds planted. That's pretty cool. Well, that's another good thing to know. This is here. I didn't... I didn't actually... Okay, I get both. That's fine. As long as I get both, I'll pick these out of the ground. And then I'll plant these right near my base. Okay, cool. So this is an area we haven't quite explored all of yet, but we've basically explored the majority of it. 
Oh. You want to pick up the twigs too, mate. I'm already... I'm running out of inventory room. I need to make a chest when we get back to the base as well. This is getting a bit beyond a joke. On how little inventory room I actually have now. And let's get some more logs cut down, because I believe for the chest I'm going to make boards. I think... Chest, 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 chest. Where would it be? Uh, I'm not sure. Maybe I need to... To be, like, near the science machine to even see it. God damn it. Get another axe on the go. So what did I say the max stack size? Oh, I can't carry this. What I can do though is I'll head back down to this other farm. Where is it? Just here. And I'll plant it in here. There we go. Nice. I just gotta keep an eye on my food. I'm getting a little bit low now. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to like look at some more Don't Starve gameplay and rely on the comments section for you guys and girls to give me all the tips that I possibly need to survive this first playthrough to a decent um, amount of days. I don't have a lot of confidence in myself because normally I like to like know a little bit more about the game before I start playing it. And this game, I've watched a bit of it, but I really haven't extensively like thought about what I'm doing in it. I haven't, like, memorized shit very well, so I'm just kind of going on the fly and learning as we go along here. Uh, let's eat these petals as well. Is there anything I could really get rid of right now? Like, anything I really don't need? Not, honestly, no. Um, probably that, actually. I'd rather have an extra stack of logs. Oh, we need all the twigs we can get. Right, so that's going to stop up here, it looks like. I don't know whether it goes off into any other direction. Or whether it just drops. Yeah, it just stops up here. Okay. So, we're a little bit far from home. I mean, I guess we could uh, outlast the night now. We've got plenty of twigs to keep making torches. Ooh, we can try the fishing rod out. Oh no, there's a mosquito there. Ah, oh, fuck! You piece of human garbage. Can I kill this son of a bitch? Oh, shit. I killed him. I nearly died, but I killed him. Ooh. Hey, I healed all the way. So is that going to happen every time I try to fish? No. Ooh! I got a fish! Nice! Yes! Give me all the fish, dude! This is great! Ooh, and it gives me health, so it probably might give me more health if I cook it. Alright, we gotta watch out. Our food's getting a little low. I can eat the carrots, though. Dude. Awesome. Alright, so we actually have a pond reasonably close to our base. That's a good sign. Alright, let's also watch out for tentacle monsters. That could potentially um, do me up the butt, and that wouldn't be good. Are we gonna make it home in time, or am I gonna have to light this torch up? I guess I'll just light it up. If we don't make it home in time, that's fine. <laughs> we'll just make it. Just in the nick of time. Alright. So... I need to know whether there's recipes for this fish that I could make in the crock pot that would actually give me more benefit, that would be good to know. 
Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to look up, I think, is probably the easiest way. Also, the chest that I wanted to make. Let's see. Huh, we could make that, actually. Uh, there's a straw roll, which helps me sleep through the night. The nights aren't very long anyway. So, I mean, I'm not super worried about it. A thermal stone. Structures. Is it under structures? It is under structures. So, I need three boards. One, two, three. This is mainly in case Chester dies, is the main reason why I'm making it. So, we have something more permanent here. Um, because the last thing I want is to have Chester die and then we've got nothing to store our items in. So, like, the extra logs, um, well, we don't actually have extra, like, the cooked, the caps we could put in there, the pine cones we could put in there, this metal potato thing that someone's gonna have to tell me what the hell that is in the comments. Um, we can put that there as well. Okay, beautiful. Alright, give me a moment. Alright, guys and girls, so I'm gonna try making some fish sticks, okay? Um... I'm not sure how it works, but I think it's just this plus a twig. And then we can cook that. And it should hopefully make some fish sticks. Ah, oh, shit, I better just eat this quickly. Just so I don't die while I'm making this. I was getting real low on food then. I didn't pay attention. How long is this going to take to cook is the question. I guess let's just cook these. While we wait, because otherwise we're going to die. And I'd prefer not to lose health. Oh, this gives me three health back as well. That's nice. Um, and let's also plant these, I guess. Let's put the farming area back. Uh, I could replant it closer to home. Whoops. Uh, da -da. Do, 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 Um, what? I know that's not a straight line, I apologise, I'm sorry, I tried. Oh, nice. It gave us one fish stick. 40 health, though! Oh, that is fucking amazing. Yes, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Protects you from some damage. To be honest, probably... Oh, wait, I, I have made this one before, haven't I? Oh, I'm an idiot. Alright, well, I've got two log suits now. Hey, great. Fuck. Oh, man, we're nearly at max health again. Nice. Alright, we're doing good, we're doing good, we're getting there. Um, Now, what did I need for more fishing rods? Okay, I've got the stuff I need to make another fishing rod. Which is good. Uh, probably should just drop off the charcoal and maybe the rope, because I don't really need to carry it with me at the moment. Uh, let's put the charcoal in there and the rope. Um, and maybe the reeds for now. Just to free up some room in our inventory. Let's just put this up here, put that there. Alright, so I want to head up a little bit. Now, I should be exploring more of the map, is what I'm being told. So, to be honest, we probably should explore up in this region here. Now, we know the pond's right here too, which is fantastic to have right close to us. Right, so, just gotta watch out for tentacle monster assholes that wanna mess with my shit. And we've actually got... another gold rock here. I knew that was going to break in a sec. Alright, let's get another one. Do, 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 do. Good, we're getting plenty of flint, which is... Oh. Nearly missed some, which is good. Right, let's keep exploring. Let's see what's up the pathways. Alright, so this joins on to the other pathway with bees around it. Which I guess if I kill the bees, I can get honey off of them. Which actually makes me wonder, what did I need for the bug? Oh, I can't make the bug net on the fly, can I? I have to be bee mine. Weaponized bees, what could go wrong? Damn! Alright, so I actually need to be... Investigate suspicious dirt pile. Uh, 
Examine animal track. Track less by food, I mean an animal. Hmm. That normally means there's like there could be beefalo nearby, right? Is that is that how it works? I wonder if we could sneak Oh! I was about to say, I wonder if we could sneak up on that guy and, and fuck him up, but... I guess that's probably not the way we can do that. What the fuck? Pick evil flower, pick up ring thing. What is this? Eat. It probably fucks with my sanity, right? Uh, I'll tell you what, we'll pick him up. I don't know what it does, and I'm probably breaking something in the game that I'm gonna get told off about. But we'll put these up in here, just for now. Whoops. Let's get some more health too. So we've got a wormhole there. Don't really want to jump in the wormhole, to be honest. People will have to also let me know in the comments about the wormholes as well, because they confuse me a little bit. Uh, their purpose, at least, confuses me. Okay, so this is going... Oh, we could find maybe... Maybe find beefalo over here. Maybe. We got spiders. That's always good. Love me some spiders. Alright, so... This map's got an interesting design. I just want to skirt the edge so I can get an idea of what parts I have to search. Let's just slowly pick up petals and get our health back as we go. Our sanity's going down quite a bit too. Now, I'm not super worried about it. I'm so hungry. Um. Yeah, probably not a good idea to have come all this way without food in mind. Kind of my bad. I could make a campfire if I get desperate to cook food, though. Hmm. I was kind of hoping I would find some beefalo by now, but not seeing anything. This is just a huge grasslands area, like a fucking massive grasslands area. This is ridiculous. Why is it so big? Giggity. Hmm. Okay, this is just dumb, dude. Hi, how you doing? I see you. How you doing, big fella? My light just ran out. No, it didn't. We got a backup, don't worry. Oh! Is that them or is that beefalo? Oh, we found it. They're sleeping. Interesting. Alright, so we've got beefalo here. This is good to know. This is fantastic, actually. Alright, we better... Okay, we do run faster on the path, so I was wondering that. I thought we were. I thought you, you go way quicker when you're on the path. Alright, so this is good. We can grab some manure. And we're definitely going to have to think of... Um, I was thinking about attacking them, but I think they'd probably kill me pretty quickly. Um, if we could get... Where's my spear? If we could kill one of these guys, that would be good. Damn it! They all get in the hole too quickly. Okay, we better use this path, and we better try and think about getting back. Or oh, maybe. <laughs> Fucking pricks. Uh, better think about going back to base, because otherwise I will starve to death, and that would not be fun. So, I'm gonna eat one of these. Yes, it does. It fucking reduces my sanity, which is what I thought it did. Okay, good to know. Just thought I'd, I'd confirm that. Uh, we'll use the paths to, to speed this up a little bit. Let's get over to that path there. Come on, move your ass. 
and let's just keep eating petals again, like I said, to gain back health as we slowly go along here. You reckon we can attack this? Fuck. Okay, we're just taking a lot of health damage here. Hey! Knock it a fuck off! I get it, I got it, it's good, alright, I'm sorry, fuck! Give me your flowers. Far out. Alright, let's just move real quick down this path. Alright, so I'm gonna be pissed if I only needed one fish to get those fish sticks, and I just wasted like two or three fish. To be honest, I think we actually have to try and quickly get some fish. Um... Please, no mosquitoes. Ah, come on. Alright. We've got a couple now, which is good. We can eat this for food as well. We should, we should be fine. I'm like consciously watching it now. Ooh, wait, what's this? We've already got crops? Seriously? Oh, shit! Oh, corn! Nice, dude. Nice. I think we can make, like, something out of the corn. We can make fish tacos if we wanted to. But it doesn't give nowhere near as much health as the fish sticks do. Huh. Yeah, okay. So let's... Let's see here. I think it says we can just use the one fish to make the fish tacos, so that's what I'm going to do, and then I think we're going to end off the episode. Oh, twigs should hopefully grow. Right, so we open the crock pot, and we just put the one twig in there. Put one twig, and one fish. Hmm. Okay, it looks like, yeah, it has to be full. Interesting. Alright, so let's... Uh, can I use... I know I shouldn't probably use the dark petals to do that, but I'm hungry. I don't care. Alright, so we do need to get one more fish to make the the fish target or the, the fish sticks. So we'll do that um, for the massive health gain that we can get. And also the fact that, like, basically, while we live near this pond, we've infinitely got food relatively easily. Because um, we can just keep making fishing rods for the most part as we could just keep farming the spiders for fishing rods and then keep having fish ticks to feed us which is great i think you can only use from what i read about the fishing rod you only get nine uses out of the fishing rod which is kind of shitty um it's not really that many i just ran past the pond like an idiot uh, let's eat the seeds as well Shit. Okay, uh, where's my spear? Alright, let's just take this bitch out real quick. Have him go for his attack, and then hit him. Ah, uh, he runs! Alright, let's just not worry about him for a minute. You piece of shit. Oh, I don't like you. You're gonna piss me off. Come here. Sweet. Thank you. Okay. Let's get our, our one extra fish that we need. Beautiful. Good, 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 good. Alright, so we're going to have to remember to keep replanting that garden too, because that was like a really good source of... um of food for us, honestly. We can just keep replanting the garden and everything and then just 
keep growing crops from there. It's honestly a great strategy. Alright, let's head down the path, head back to base, make the fish sticks, and we'll end off this episode. Man, you really zoom on the path in comparison to the, like, the grassland. Like, you really take a big movement speed hit when you when you get onto the grass. I'm gonna grab the acorns out of, uh, the, ch the chest, actually. Um, because I'll use those for the fire. Make a nice big fire. And then let's open the crock pot and put this fish in here. Boom, cook. Let that cook for a minute. So, someone will have to tell me what this ring does. I don't know. Can I put it in any of these slots? I cannot. So, someone will have to let me know what that actually does for me. Oops. I also always accidentally pause. Now, and also, I'll have to get told what other items I could get. See, that's what I wanted to make. I wanted to make the hand bat, which is a pig skin, two meat, and the twigs. Um, but unfortunately, like, the spiders killed the pig and ate the fucking meat. Like a bunch of assholes, so I didn't get a chance to actually consume it. Man, that's good. 37.5... Hunger, 40 health, and 5 sanity. That is good. Especially for the health. The food, not as much, but the health is insane. Now, I wonder, could we plant the corn if we if we went to an area to plant it? That is something else I want to know in the comments section. So, anyway, guys and girls, that is going to be the end of this episode. If you did like it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more Don't Starve in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching. Ooh, actually, you know what? No, no, we'll save it for another episode. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. All right, poise.